What's up everybody, welcome back to episode 10 of Nightmares from the Deep, The Siren's Call. In the last episode, we... what did we do? We made... Ah yes, that's right, we unlocked the door to the prison and just as we suspected, we would catch a glimpse of Calliope before she was snatched away by, uh, by Mayor Murray. Just as we suspected. So now we are on a mission to infiltrate Old Mate downstairs, which I currently forgot his name. What is his name? Uh, this guy. We need to get him an outfit. And we've devised a plan. We are going to get him. He needs a, uh, like a disguise so that we can infiltrate. I am currently pretending to be a. A, a wench, a kitchen wench, uh, and we are going to brew old mate a coffee because he requested it ever so rudely. But you know, we, 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 we're gonna lace that coffee just with a little bit of spicy <laughs> sleeping powder, right? So then he's gonna pass out, and we're likely going to steal his outfit and we're gonna give it to old mate. So that is the plan, but before we can do that, we need to find a coffee grinder. So that is our current mission and goal. So we're going to check out the map first to see if there's any place we need to search. Nothing jumps out at us. Okay, so we need to find a coffee grinder. Where would a coffee grinder be? We also need to find the other idle head. Oh, hold on, there was a thing that we could check here. Oh no, fine. Okay. Anything else in here? Oh yeah, so we also need to find the eyeball to this. Let's have a little bit of a wander around and see what we can find. Anything else that we can grab? Nope. We actually haven't found a, another coin in a little bit, so... Maybe we might find another one in this episode. I have a feeling it's probably going to be one in this. I'm still curious as to what this resin might be. Uh, we've... ...done that. I completely forgot about this. It would be more useful with matching hands. So we need to also find... So that's likely months. This is um, seconds. We got hours and minutes. Zero to nine. Zero to nine. Milliseconds? This is interesting. I don't know what that is. Hmm. Nothing in here that we haven't done. 
Fish curse, we read this. Doesn't appear to be anything. We already did that. I'm trying to think of if there's any other puzzles that we are uh, yet to remember. I think we're I think we pretty much done everything around here. Let's see. I doubt there's anything all the way over here. Well, let's have a look. Are we in the tavern? Now I did everything in here as well. Well, if you want to denounce me before the mayor, at least let me finish the bottle. I think we've done everything. All right, let's uh, let's have a let's have a look around. Oh, kitchen! I know what we have to. This is maybe the grinders in the kitchen. Passengers' cabin. Okay, yeah, because we checked. Oh, maybe there might be a grinder in here. Get like a bar. Alright. So any other place that might have a grinder? I doubt it. Alright. Let's, let's head back. Baby in here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Surely there's a coffee grinder in the kitchen. Maybe it is in the... Oh wait, hold on. I didn't read what this said. What symbol could be missing in the coffee... Oh, in the... In the crate filled with coffee beans. symbol could be missing in a crate filled with coffee cans. What symbol? I think a can symbol? I don't know what that means.
Hmm. too bad. Hey, perfect. Good as new. Let's give that a grind. Pop that in the cup. Two of those. And then we just add ourselves our water. Now, Typically, you would strain it, but sure. Right. Uh, let's put in our little bit of extra. Alright. G'day, old mate. Here's a, your coffee. Hope you choke on it. Objective. Seems as though someone's fallen asleep. Prepare what? for the onslaught. I'll meet you at the embankment after I deal with the siren and call the Kraken. Oh, is this where we're gonna fight the Kraken? Okay, yeah, we got the cool. Oh, we got the cool uh, carriage. Like octopus. Okay, so we need. Oh, I think I think I remember seeing that symbol somewhere. Quarters. The Praetorians stay to protect the mayor. A couple of places to go. Oh, 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 mate! Like fully asleep. coin in there. Piranhas, they could rip me to pieces. Well, actually, that's not true. They go on a feeding frenzy when there is blood in the water, but they're actually very... like... precise. They don't just go crazy. They know exactly what they're doing. They only eat... I'm pretty sure they only eat, like... Wounded or like dying. So I just noticed that fish's mouth is like detaching from it. That's an interesting way of making it look like it's it's swimming. It's kind of like randomizing the position a little bit of their features. That's uh, an interesting technique. It doesn't work for that, but it's a interesting idea. Hey, there's the other thing. Never seen this eye before. Yes, let's yoink it. Oh, we got a chest. A lid panel is missing from the chest. Okay. I think that's what was on the carriage. We'll take that. Praetorian, I put to sleep. He could go wrench himself. <laughs> I, I agree. <laughs> uh, however, I better keep quiet. Joel. Anything else in here before we eat? Nope. Alright, well, let's give old mate the outfit, but first I want to put this on here. Hey! I will take that. See, I knew we'd get a coin in this. A hanging weight. 
Ah, this is the piece that I, that I saw. Crap. Bell, pedal, uh, a bowl, a prison cap, and a hanging weight. Did I read that wrong? Or was I... Hmm. Okay, well that's for the carriage. Alright. G'day, mate. Help you until you procure me a Praetorian uniform. Here is Thanks your uniform. uniform. You're really quite resourceful. Must be the curator in you. Now <laughs> I can blend in with the Praetorians. <laughs> I'll try to lead them astray and clear you a path to the tower. Meet me by the yard. I'll do my best to help you. Look, I had to curate the stuff somehow. Alrighty. Well, I think we're going to give old mate a coin. After witnessing these atrocities, many people turned away from Mayor Murray, terrified of his ruthlessness. Those who remained by his side were the most dangerous and vicious rogues of Kingsmouth. Murray honored his faithful followers by deeming them an elite force called the Praetorians. Uh... Like dogs at a master's command, they pillaged the ships and kept the townspeople in check. All right. Do you have something for me? I do not right now. Let's infiltrate. All right. Are you ready? I'll take care of those two. Hey. Mate, you are the most suspicious. Damn. Okay, that was pretty good. Alright, well, you, you kind of redeemed yourself from that time on the bridge. Where you got... <laughs> We got slapped off. It changed. Did it? Are you playing spot the difference? Watch closely and mark all the morphing objects. I wasn't paying attention. Oh.
I missed it. Where is it? Wait, I missed it again. No, I don't want no hint. Oh, it's down here. Ooh. What is this? Elevator emblem. If it weren't for that siren, I would have already brought destruction and death upon the unlucky passenger of the Albatross, or whatever that ship is called. But this, uh, yes, that's right, lad. But this pleasure will have to wait. First, I will lock Calliope in her new watery cell in my apartment and interrogate her. She had to have help. Uh, oh, okay, so that's what he's doing. Uh, then it's time to call uh, the Kraken. Okay, so he's interrogating her to get info on him, I'm assuming. Nope. Think it does say it is for an elevator, so... Alright, let's go. That went well. But we still have to find Calliope and stop Murray before he commands the Kraken to destroy the ship. I'll go to the embankment to try to delay preparations and keep an eye on the Praetorians. They're less likely to recognize me since I'm in uniform. In the meantime, search the upper floors of the lighthouse for Calliope. If you can free her, then she will surely find some way to contain the Kraken. Good luck. Alright. Time to use the elevator. Oh. Oop. Tell me, Calliope, what did you think would happen if you escaped? I have your deposit in my chest. That means I have all your power. Don't you have anything to say? Speak, now. I can wait here all day. <laughs> Shoot him in the back. Okay, we got the treasure chest key. Wait, oh, where was the treasure chest? It was over here. Alright. Wait, where? Oh, here we go. Is that not? Open. It's only going that hole, which might be this. So, oh, I see. Um, 
Nice. Nope. Okay, right, so that goes in here. Take that. Grab ourselves a cane and a wing. Is there another wing somewhere? Oh, very interesting. Clear what the keys for. Uh, oh, there's our other wing. Goes on here. This cracker. Now the question is which one wants it? Oh, is this the fun the idol? Am I going to? Oh, never mind. Figured it out. A boom. Get out and hide. Murray is coming. La 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 la. Inside, I can't hold out much longer. <laughs> well, that works. I returned just in time. Now that Murray is locked up, he can't stop us. I fooled the Praetorians into waiting for the mayor's arrival before they attack. We have to use this borrowed time wisely. You have to free Calliope while I search for the missing golden fish token for Davy Jones's chest. Once we open the chest, we can return Calliope's deposit and restore her powers. Then, she can tame the Kraken. Hurry, before the Praetorians guess that something is fishy. Or worse, before Murray breaks down that door. We better split up to cover more ground. Try and help Calliope. Alright. Well, we're reaching the end of this episode, so we're gonna have to help Calliope in the next one. This episode was pretty good, we got a bit of animation going on, like some actual 3D animation. So, like, proper proper cutscenes, if I like. So, we didn't have a proper cutscene, I think... Actually, I think when he... I, th I think the last proper cutscene was with the ship approaching, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, and then before that was... Him using the Kraken statue to create to create Carl. I guess it could do that, <laughs> which is interesting. Um, yeah, we have to use the idol or the thing uh, in the kitchen. Uh, I'm not sure what that would get us, but I'm assuming it's going to help us unlock the thing for Calliope. So we're going to do that in the next episode and we're going to get some more coins to open up the chest because that's... I'm pretty sure the chest is where... No, I think the chest in the quarters in here is where the Kraken statue is 
maybe or oh, he put it in the 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 chest with the with the with the man with the the chest keeper either way we need to unlock that to get the uh, horn thing i have a feeling we're gonna have to get that to give it to calliope so she can have her powers back maybe uh but yeah we'll, we'll find that out in the next episode um, but yeah, if you guys are enjoying this series, definitely leave a like, all that sort of stuff, comments, etc. Uh, like I said in the end of the last episode as well, uh, we're going to be coming up to the end of uh, this series. And we have uh, actually potential, yeah, we, oh, hold on, Let's see, get distracted and I lose what I'm saying. But we found another bit. Um, yeah, so uh, with the with this series coming to an end and now uh, Resident Evil series coming to an end, uh, we are going to be playing some more games. Now, obviously, this one we still have the third game for this series uh, to play, so we're going to be moving on to that after this. But we have a a new game to to kind of play. Uh, after after Resident Evil, so if you guys still, I'm still looking for suggestions. If you guys have any, I've I've got some other games that I'm gonna gonna play. But if you have any kind of specific games that you reckon I would enjoy, all that sort of stuff, leave a leave a comment below. I'm interested on whatever games you want me to play, um, to kind of check them out. So uh, any suggestions, just leave them below, and yeah. Uh, what do you guys think of this series so far? Um, have you been enjoying it? Have you Has this made you want to play it? Which, actually, for those who might want to play this, uh, the way I've been getting the games, because this, this game series, for some strange, unknown reason, is not on Steam. Uh, the way that I'm playing this is it's through a, um, a launcher called Big Fish. I think is uh, I think they're the distributor for these sorts of games um, so you can download their launcher and you can actually play um, and download like a, a ton of games they have so many of these types of games uh, on their launcher so uh, if you're wanting to play this uh, just uh, Google Big Fish that's the distributor I'm pretty sure for uh, for this game and a ton of other games similar to this um, so yeah if you want to play it check that check out them and uh yeah i think yeah we basically we're gonna end the episode here but yeah i uh, thank you guys so much for watching uh your your viewership over this series has been going up so i thank you guys for coming back for those who have and for any new people uh welcome uh it's good to have you here um our goal our goal for this uh channel is well, our current goal is to get to 50 subscribers so if you're enjoying these series and uh the other series i have on this channel please do hit the subscribe button uh that helps out this channel uh, i want to i want to build this channel up but i'm going to create some milestones so we got 50 subscribers and um the goal is to i think youtube wants I think it's it might be 200 subscribers to start get I can't, I can't remember what the subscriber count is but if I want to get this uh, channel monetized I have to reach certain milestones so I'm I'm striving towards that but that's actually not the reason why I made this channel I just kind of enjoy playing games and it's hard for me to to play games while I'm making them so I figured you know what I'll give myself an excuse to to play some games by creating a YouTube channel. Uh, and it gives me the chance to not only play the games and kind of share that with you guys, but also to kind of talk about it. Uh, I, I made this channel to kind of talk about uh, aspects that I like about the games and kind of give you guys a perspective from maybe like a, a game developer who spends more of their time making games, uh, if you guys want that kind of perspective. so. That's kind of the purpose of this channel. So if you if you guys uh, enjoy those, those sorts of aspects, uh, you might also enjoy my other channel, which uh, is uh, called the Wizard Tower. Over there, I do my wizardry magic and kind of show you guys how to do uh, pretty much anything CG is kind of what I'm aiming to do uh, on that channel. So that's things like self-geared towards game development, but also uh, 
out of anything uh, visual effects related. Uh, I prob There's probably stuff uh, that I'll be posting in the future related to that. I know there was a few people that commented uh, on a video from five years ago uh, that I did on muscle rigging. So I, I will definitely want to do a tutorial on that. I'm just kind of uh, waiting to kind of for the right moment to do that. Uh, so oh, there's there's a lot of stuff that I got planned coming in the future on that channel and this channel. So yeah, I'm rambling on at this point, trying to plug everything. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this episode and you're enjoying the series, leave a like and all that sort of stuff. And I will see you guys in the next episode. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching.